hello 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 and welcome back to plans on planning here we are in my fitness planner you see we got some wonderful things done last week and now it's time to turn the page and get this week going now as you notice i'm keeping it simple and i do want to continue with that because like i was telling you last week i was getting so overly consumed with making sure the fitness planner looked good and like not even more so just the aesthetic appeal of the fitness planner but it was just all about the fitness planner and making sure things were filled in and I had the inspiration and I had the motivation and I just got too consumed with the planner itself so I decided to take a step back to keep it simple where I'm getting exactly what I need. So I'm um, making sure I have my meals recorded. I'm making sure I have my workouts recorded. And that's it. All that other stuff that made it look cute and pretty and blah, blah, blah. I'm letting that go. For the month. To see how it works. Because I may jump back in the next month. But this month I am sticking to the basics. And it... As you can see, worked out pretty well for me. The only day I missed working out was Tuesday, and that is because I accidentally overslept. And let's not even get into it. Like I don't, I don't even know what happened. Like I was like, I'm gonna take a quick nap. Um, that quick nap wasn't as quick <laughs> as I thought it was gonna be, and it wound up being a long nap. So of course, you know, didn't get to work out. But here's a new week new goals and we're going to get things done and that starts with stickers so yes i am still using stickers but i'm keeping them simple and focused directly on workouts and food that's it anything outside of that doesn't even matter to me workouts and food so I have workout stickers I have exercise stickers I have I don't know let's get to it stickers <laughs> I don't know what you want to call them but that's my focus like I said it's been working to be very honest now I do know that I will be out of town so I don't know I'm going to try to do um, workouts for the weekends, but I don't know. It's going to be kind of difficult, to be honest. I don't know. Like, even working out on Friday might be difficult because I have a plane to catch, but... So, I'm going to try to get a little exercise in. Oh, I can exercise in the afternoon on Friday. But Sunday, I'm going to be spending it with the family. So, I may get a little something something in. But if it happens, it happens. If it doesn't, it doesn't. There's my little inspo. A little do this for Jewel. And I'm going to put that on both sides. Do this for Jewel. Um, I have this lovely Feel the Burn sticker. Alright, so. I got these little walking dudes that I love to put for some strange reason. <laughs> Ask me why. But I just love to add him. He's part of my simplicity. I think I like it because it's gold, to be honest. He's a golden man. Who makes my heart stop.
There we go. Now, as you know, I love to write in my breakfast, lunch, and dinner. So I'm not going to steer away from that. I can tell you, I'm just keeping it really simple. Like, yeah, I'm adding a little flair, but at the end of the day, I'm keeping it super freaking simple. And really, I'm not trying to deter much from this right here. I'm going to write in some things, and that's it. I don't want too much going on to be too much of a distraction, honestly speaking. So let's get our handy dandy pen out. I think I want to write it in this color. Um, my fine liners that I love ever so much. And I'm just writing in breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Let them all breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Um, let's do brunch. Uh, and dinner. Brunch. And dinner. Ha! Because it's the weekend. Let's be honest about what's really going on. Brunch and dinner. Alright, so some goals for this week. Um, I did really good with my 3K per day. So I want to keep that up. And then I also... Faltered a little bit on my two liters per day at work. But you'll be happy to know that I did good with my habit tracker. So I have my vitamins. I didn't hit every day to be honest, but I did better than normal. Um, I got my workouts in. So I want to add that. Um, I was drinking water every day, but like I said, I didn't hit my goal of the two liters per day at work. Um, and then my sleep, ha, which I killed. I got about six and a half hours in on average, um, which is actually really freaking good for me to be extremely honest. So there we have it. Here is my fitness planner for the week or my weekly spread and my fitness planner for the week. I have some weekly goals that I want to achieve, which I need to figure out some more weekly goals. So if you have any ideas of any weekly goals, um, go ahead and leave a comment. I did mention, and I hope she doesn't mind um, me talking about it, but someone did leave a comment on the last video that they had a problem with taking their vitamins, so she drinks vitamin water, which knocks out two of the goals, basically. So it ups the water intake and ups your vitamin intake um, to make sure. I did um, do a little shopping, and I did up my vitamins, so I did find another vitamin to take, um, a nice um, multivitamin to help me out to make sure that I'm getting my vitamins. I got it in gummy form, so maybe that'll make a difference. It's like, ooh, I want to eat the gummy. I'm thinking outside the box, something that'll help me <laughs> along the way so hopefully now that i have some vitamins that are gummies i'm gonna be a tad bit more excited to eat my gummies every day 
I don't know. I'm thinking, I'm trying, you know, new ideas, never hurt anybody. But if you have any ideas on any goals or different ways to help me stay on track with my goals and my habit tracker, definitely leave a comment below. Like I said, I read them and I implement them. If it works for me, I'm definitely going to try to implement them at the very least. Um, we're all in this together. The best way to stay on track fitness is accountability. So it's really awesome to have an accountability partner. And you guys basically are my accountability partners. So I hope you feel honored and I hope you feel special. But nonetheless, because I could definitely go on all day about this. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, you can definitely drop something below. Um, you can email me if you feel more comfortable emailing me. Don't forget to follow me on social media. Um, and then hit me on the DM and let me know that you saw the video. You have questions, you have concerns, you want to talk about something, whatever the case may be. Um, if you have any fitness related questions, any health, any wellness questions, you can hit me with those as well. I do run a fitness blog on the road to fitness.com. So there's tons of information there. Definitely sign up for the mailing list. So you're in the loop on everything. But in the meantime, in between time, I will see you guys just a tad bit on the later side. So have a wonderful, wonderful workout week because I know I will with everything going on here. All right. See you guys. Bye-bye.